first few minutes. Climb water, all right, boy? Let the intruder dig it up wherever you buried it. For violence!
Attention students, this is the pre-recorded voice of your pre-recorded principal, Dr. Principal Boros. Step into the open and identify yourself. Law-abiding citizens have nothing to fear.
So, you put down Gabe. Thank you. A scamp, but really, his highly augmented combat programming could have proved meddlesome. In any event, thank you for putting him down. One last test subject to catalog and sort. Clearly a failure of Doggy's cybo engineering. What? Why, yes, it is. I used to leave it outside his doghouse, chock full of cans, before the cybernetic modifications, of course. And no matter how chemmed the food, he would always eat it, and his tail would wag, even, even while I, I, you know, I'm having the most perplexing feeling squiggling through my biogel. I can't quite pin it down. Why, yes, Gabe. No matter how awful my day had been, he... he was always waiting there. How odd. My gel is decoagulating. And when I would talk to him about Betsy, and how Marcus would beat on me and call me smarty sissy pants, he'd just sit there, head on my knee, and... If you don't mind, I'll take that ball. Just need to remove it. Put it away, somewhere out of radar range. For some reason, its similarity to the crater shape of Big Mountain is starting to fill up all available cognitive spaces. That, combined with my own overwhelming feeling of having done something terrible, the two were hitting me with unexpected force. As odd as it is, I believe that is the conclusion. And I wonder why it didn't hit me before, until I saw that memory in your hands. This sensation is unpleasant. I don't care for it. I don't care for this place either. And I feel as if we've forgotten something. Still, it is no matter. Crush the feeling down. Crush it down. Push it into the loop. The... Hmm. Yes. Forgotten. Almost. Yes. I do not need to remember anymore. Not today. Until next time, then. Provided there is a next time. For any of us.
How can I illuminate you? Unlike certain other light switches, I'm competent. I just love to turn those lights on for you. you a drink you're going to need to find yourself some empties first before I can fill them for you any empty bottle will do it just not too dirty okay come back anytime you want a drink or to get <clears throat> clean the haps right on baby let's spin some grooves Don't even talk to me. I've seen you with her. Oh, you're back. Did that trampy other light switch finally kick you to the curb?
Step into the open and identify yourself. Law-abiding citizens have nothing to fear.
Did you retrieve the technologies yet? We need them, as I have indicated. What? You did? Your survival, let alone success, barely registered in my projections. Now, all I need to do is check my transmission data bank. Mobius is always filling it up with his psychotic calls. Oh yes, there's the schematics, just like you said. How truthful. Yes, hmm, ah, uh, yes. Yes, yes, um, hmm. No, I mean yes. You just need to analyze these technologies for a moment. They are extremely advanced, you know? I know how these technologies work. Of course I know. If you remember, we described them in clearly abstract, contradictory statements before. Why would we do that if we weren't certain on... On how to use them. Yes. So let me... Hmm. A bit, huh? I'll figure it out. Yes, that's what I believe I said. I've got it. The cardiac regulator in the suit, the antenna for brain waves, and the sonic frequency for the vertebral nerves. I'm thinking. This is all very complicated. Let me check something. Of course, I have it. The override sequence to open the Forbidden Zone door is hidden in the schematics. Well, not hidden. It's actually right there, behind the programming equivalent of coffee stains. It's embedded in what seems to be recursive code. It's badly commented there and there. Oh, and null pointers. Very sloppy, Mobius. You see, using the antenna to boost the emitter's sonic frequency, and the stealth suit to bypass the Forbidden Zone lock, yes, that could work. Was that my plan? It must have been. Sometimes I truly surprise myself. The door is open, and now Mobius will get his. Biological? <laughs> Ridiculous. I mean, technically, these items could all be used to put you back together once you had your brain. But for now, they can be used in the name of aggression. The door should be unsealed. Now, instead of being subjected to threats, we can now send an equally threatening message to Mobius. And that message is science! Deliver this message! And Big Mountain shall be freed from Mobius's reign of terror. Um, you can go now. That's your cue. <laughs>